one of the things that's really special and unique about this house is how it really preserves New England vernacular and New England style architecture, which on the Cape and Islands, it's known for its weathered shingles, its simple corner boards, use of shutter blinds on the windows, the proper pins and holdbacks. If you notice on the downspout, it's highly detailed. We were able to recreate that entryway from photographic documentation. So we feel very proud about having these component pieces represent itself today, but really tell the story of the, of the history of the house. Well, I'll tell you, it's a pleasure for Jackie and I to welcome you and to have you articulate the history and the work that you did for us. And it's something we enjoy every day. Thank you so much. This archival research really became an important piece to unfolding the history of the house. That Square Bay window, that's from 1682. And when we were residing the house and reframing it, we had to surgically remove that bay and have it brought out and all the copper work restored. And, and then being able to reinsert it in the house, I thought was a, a really nice gesture that we didn't recreate it. We actually reconstructed the original window. And, and that, again, is something we're so grateful for and we enjoy it every day. And since we've been here for over 20 years, something I've learned since we were last together, um, as we know, the home was John Coffin's. What I didn't connect at the time was that his father, uh, Trisman, was best friends with Mayhew, who was the governor for the king, and that this house, the first house that John built, was because Mayhew invited him here. They needed a blacksmithy. I was not aware of that history, and I share it with you because it documents all the way back to that window. Recalls of the past that Amazing. I think make it special. It is special, and I thank you for preserving it for us and making it livable. As I look here now with the water glistening and the sailboats bobbing about, it's really this element of delight that not only do you enjoy, but any passerby gets a glimpse of the harbor that I think is really wonderful that you and your family recognize the importance of giving back to the public. That kind of element you brought to us, we had no idea of the importance to keep a view like that open for everyone who comes to Egerton. And I think it's really special. This is really the messages of the past and how to have the house live where you want to live today, but really tell the story of how this house grew over time. That we simply said we wanted to be thoughtful of the history, but you have the gift of doing that and bringing it in to making it so comfortable for us. Well, thank you. And I share that with many people because it's hard to do with an old home.